Hello and welcome. My name is Amul and you are watching Tumint. In this video, I'm going to show you a Brooklyn theme 2.0 with a custom page customizer template. So basically, the vintage Brooklyn theme is in this particular video is already upgraded to Shopify 2.0 templates which is a JSON template and what it does it lets you add these sections on any template so in the vintage theme you're not able to add section to like any template you were only able to add sections to this particular home page template but now since this theme has been upgraded I can add templates to product page. You can see this is default template. So you can see I can add section. These are sections. And then once a section is added, I would have access to the blocks as well. All right. And so you can see this is available on every template so that was product page default product template now this is going to be a default collections template and I have access to the sections I can add sections to this template as well now let's move on to collections list template and here as well I can add sections now let's have a look at the page so even on the pages template i do have it's just trying to load sometimes it takes time so this is default one default template but on this particular template i have created an alternate template with few additional features so this gives you ability to customize your let's say you want to promote a page on a certain uh, time it could be a season seasonal sale or it could be a festival so if you just click on this page customizer you would be able to change everything so nav color uh, footer bg you see you are able to change so this particular page will be completely outer bg so outer bg is just just behind the list. so let's say we want to keep it like that i mean that's totally up to your page so there is another layer wrapper in between the body text so if I go ahead and yeah, so that's what I was talking about. So then image background. So let's say you have yeah this image. So image background could be anything. So that's basically your border to images. Uh, I think you can in increase the padding if you want. Yeah. Uh, then we can customize our fonts on the on this particular template mm -hmm. so uh, this is h1 which is here so let's say you want to go so it's totally up to you what color you want to go with then i have a background so that's the background i also can increase the h1 font size and the padding which is basically then we have h2 similar feature that we have with so h1 and then we have h2 h2 background it could be whatever you want right and then we have do i have padding Yes. Uh, size 
is also available so you can increase the font size then we have h3 uh, i think this is h2 yeah somewhere here h3 and then paragraph so let me quickly change the color background color sort of yeah same and then um, paragraph i don't want to give any background color to paragraphs they look okay uh, this should be in the center so I probably should add some customizers as well for the images alignment so that's the template particular template customizer I can go ahead and save it and uh, create create let me see if I have some page using that particular template um about no so it's using the standard template Let's see so i can go ahead and change the template go to customizer so now you can see these all templates are in json so just a moment this is oh no I, I need to go to this pages thing so pages and then go to oh, content about I guess and then change the template to alternate save it now I can go and view the template so this is what we customized just a while ago so this particular page will not be the same as other pages on the on this particular store so if i go to okay so if i go to another page you say clients you'll see this will be completely different all right folks so okay so i need to just add a few things here it's missing the header bar I guess uh, so this particular section so let's have a look so if you already have a Brooklyn theme installed the vintage Brooklyn theme installed on your store and you would like to upgrade I think that's the, uh, this is the best way to do you simply go ahead and migrate your liquid templates and anything that you want to upgrade basically uh, as per keeping the architecture of dot theme in mind to speed up the store and uh, kind of use the same theme again uh, yeah if you need this particular theme you can contact me i will leave my email in the description if you have any questions suggestion leave in the comment below Thank you for watching. Have a good day. So this is what we have here.